Hey y'all, it is football Saturday, and today we are going to be tailgating with some friends at the Carolina Gamers. We tailgate in style. And the thing is, y'all, we have not been tailgating in years. The last time I went tailgating, my daughter's 12, it was before she was born. I'm going to have to say it's probably been 15 years. I was probably in my mid-20s and now I'm 40. I'm excited. It's been a long time. My husband, who's a huge football fan, he's super excited about it. I think I'm more excited about him being excited. <laughs> And this will be Millie's very first time going. So we're going to bring you along and let you see how we tailgate. This is awesome. Where are the extra city? So we're going to walk from here all the way over there. That feels good. All right, y'all wave. My first and only drink of the day. It's got Prosecco and cranberry juice, and it's either called an Azalea or a Poinsettia. Drink it. Oh, yeah, I guess I should. <laughs> I guess I should drink it. Very light and refreshing. Alright, y'all, we got some cheese dip going. It looks like um, it's Velveeta cheese, sausage, and Rotel tomatoes, and then meatballs that have ketchup and jelly, and it's Italian meatballs. So good. So one of the foods we are bringing to the tailgate party today, it's called Grill Master Munch Mix. And y'all, this is an idea I came up with, and it was kind of based off of the silly M&M casserole that you might have seen where people just take a whole bunch of M&Ms and they just dump them together and basically call it a casserole. And so this, I thought I would take several types of chips and create some kind of, not casserole from it, but kind of munchy mix from it. The chips that I have, um, it's all based off of like things that you might put on hamburgers or hot dogs. And so we're gonna have fried pickle chips, got mustard and ketchup chips have onion chips now those are the sour cream and onion chips so just ignore the sour cream part and then the cheese chips I got the cheddar and sour creams they do make queso chips but I'd already bought those and didn't want to spend extra money on queso so that's one thing we're taking <laughs> when the pimp's in the crib, Ma, drop it like it's hot. Drop it like it's hot. <laughs> drop it like it's hot. <laughs> We're going to walk down to the pavilion here. Okay, cool. We'll be right back. That's 
is really cool. Lee Heisman Trophy winner from South Carolina, George Rogers. probably really loud behind us and I'm not talking about a person I'm talking about an actual fan <laughs> all right dad how's it going good are you excited to be here oh yeah it's been a while since I've been here brings back a lot of memories yeah what would y'all used to do up here up on the balcony we don't talk about that stuff anymore why not because oh come on it's unmentionable sworn to secrecy really yep so I can't mention what y'all used to do before I met you? What you what you know that we used to do. Yeah. Was it that bad? I guess so. Okay. Alright, Millie. How's it going, babe? Hot. You wanna show them your finger? Hot. You're hot? It is hot today. South Look at that. She got her she got an injury while setting up the big tents down there. Took off some skin down there. Yeah, I took out a chunk of my finger. And how did that make you feel?
We're leaving the game. Did you have fun, Millie? Yeah. Yeah. It was really cool. We are back home. It is 11.55 at night and we're exhausted, but we had a lot of fun. Didn't we, Jimmy? Yes. Yes. Jimmy had so much fun that he got chill bumps while we were at the game. And anytime it's football season, at the beginning of the football season, he gets chill bumps. It's really cute. Football holds a lot of good memories for him. Hey, Millie. Did you have fun? She had fun. We're all tired. I'm so sleepy. I'm going to bed. Thanks for coming to the game with us. Bye. Bye.